Hello, and Buffalo. This is Laura. We do. Actually, we offer every Friday night, we offer Shabbat dinner. It's free for students. We do an optional service ahead of time. Um, starting at 5.30, we do services. Um, they're student-led. Uh, they, they're they probably a, a good mixture of reform and conservative uh, services. Um, and we have student participation. Uh, after services, we do Kiddush. And after that, we have a meal um, catered uh, from a kosher deli that we have on campus. And this, well, everything's free for students. Hi, I'm Laura Hemlock. I'm the director here at Hillel of Buffalo. Uh, at Hillel here, our job is on campus. We um, try to offer services for Jewish students on campus. We offer everything from cultural, religious, social um, programs kind of all across the board. So basically, we just want to inspire and uh, for Jewish life on campus. We do weekly Shabbat dinners and services. We offer a wide variety um, for religious. We have we host services for the high holidays, Rosh Hashanah and Yom Kippur. We also host for the Seder. This past year, we did a Seder inside uh, the dorms in the Ellicott Complex. And we offer different kinds of Seder. So basically, uh, allowing Jewish students uh, to find a home away from home. We have um, a large uh, student population on campus. We have about uh, 3,000 Jewish students, both undergrad and graduate students. We try to reach everybody's needs, uh, whether it's they're interested in going to Israel. We send two birthright trips a year, one in the winter and the summer. We do um, a big, every year we do a big event called Israel Week, where we try to uh, do lots of different Israel engagement. We do cultural events. We replicated a Roma Cafe, which is kind of like the Starbucks over in Israel. We brought it here. We had a wonderful turnout. We had about 80 students who came, um, also held right in the heart of the dorms. Um, our Everything we do is student run. Um, our students come up with the programs, they design them. It's really for students run by students. We empower student leaders to kind of shape the way that they see Jewish life on campus. Currently, we have a student board of uh, both president, we have um, secretary, treasurer, we have, we're embracing the Jewish Student Union and we're allowing students to run, uh, kind of run the show. And we have also council coordinators who focus on Israel programming, social, SEDEC, which is community service and social justice, and uh, religious and educational. And the students kind of, they, they see what students are interested in. We also have an internship program where students, uh, we do peer network engagement, where it's basically students go and they engage other students. They find out what they're interested in. And our, and our real goal is not you come to us all the time, but we want to be a part of campus life. We want people to see that Hillel is not just about coming to us and coming to a program. It's, it's really finding how they uh, how they embrace Jewish life and bringing it to them on campus. So we kind of exist everywhere. We try to collaborate with other organizations and it's, it's really great. Hi, my name is Jesse Nagel. I'm the student president of Hillel at Buffalo, hosted at the University of Buffalo. Um, I've been involved in Hillel for the last year and a half. I started coming to Hillel regularly last spring semester after I met, made some friends here, and uh, I haven't wanted to leave ever. Uh, my job as president is at rather tasking. Uh, what I do is I make sure that, first off, the board is happy with each other and that nobody's fighting and that everybody gets along because that enables us to work together in order to make programming, whether it be you know religious or social events that we want to do. Um, another part of my responsibilities is making sure that all my board member, my fellow board members are on task at all times. This uh, includes but is not limited to uh, constant phone communication, which means I'll call them uh, or text them uh, every other day or a couple times a week, uh, staying in constant touch with them to make sure that their programs are being developed and being put through the way they should be. Uh, I also work closely with anybody if they ever need help uh, planning a program. For, uh, most recently, uh, myself and the social coordinator, Josh Wolfeld, planned the Shabbaton to Canada for Purim. And uh, you know, he, he approached me asking for help, and as part of my responsibility, I step in and I help out when I'm needed, because I, I have the resources to do so. Um, another big, big part of it is uh, I'm the basically the liaison to the lay board, which is the board of directors for Hillel, and uh, what that means is I attend the meetings and I report what we've been doing to them so they know where the money that they're fundraising is going to. Um, 
Another uh, big part of being president is that I am the face of Hillel. So whenever anybody sees Hillel, th sees or hears or thinks of Hillel, they should see my face smiling. Um, and that's more of a person-to-person -person, uh, interaction, which is something I really like to do is, you know, at every meeting uh, or every program or every event, anything that Hillel is responsible for, I go out and I make sure I introduce myself to everybody that I've never seen before. So, for example, let's say Justin is a new uh, student who wants to become more involved in Hillel and he shows up to an event, I make it my personal business to go up to him and introduce myself and, you know, ask him, make, make sure he wants to come back, make sure he feels welcome, introduce him to all the other board members and, you know, it just, it, it's a bonding experience. It's, it's to bring people back. Uh, my name is Joe Ornstein. I am currently the Student Religious Life uh, Advisor for Hillel here. Uh, I was just recently elected uh, president for the upcoming school year. And in a nutshell, one of the, the biggest things that, I, that I've done this year has been to coordinate uh, Friday night dinners and services uh, right before the Sabbath, which is a, a very important weekly holiday uh, for a lot of the Jewish students here. Uh, so I've coordinated uh, with uh, a couple members of my committee uh, that I work with. We've coordinated uh, different events for Friday night, so it's not just the same thing every week. We've had activism events uh, where we've raised awareness and money for things like diabetes and breast cancer research. Uh, but most importantly, uh, without you know, sort of all the without all the the big things um, on a week by week basis, uh, what we've tried to do here is create a, a friendly and positive environment where Jewish students can sort of, um, to whatever level that they want to participate, they have been able to uh, participate and sort of lead a, uh, lead a healthy and fun Jewish life uh, on campus. Um, you know, even though they're however far away from home, uh, they, you know, still have a, a place and an opportunity uh, to really explore their own Judaism and, you know, be happy and proud of it. So that's, I guess, what I like to do here, what I'm happiest about and what I'm most proud about, and that's what we're going to try and uh, continue to do the next couple of years.